California has gone completely mad. I'm going to break it down, guys. Before I go any further, though, i got to get this out of the way. People always ask me, why do you wear these ridiculous sunglasses? It's not a fashion statement, my friends. I wear them because I am blind. I do not have sight privilege like all of you do. That's right, guys. All right, now please give the video here a like. Share it across all of your platforms. Subscribe if you're brand new. Click the bell to enable notifications. Hopefully you get some. Also, guys, consider sponsoring me on Patreon for as little as $5 a month. You can do so by going over to patreon.com slash conservative truth. That link can be found right down there in the description. If you not checked me out on Patreon, what are you waiting for, guys? Not only do you help me out, you throw a couple bucks my way, but you also get all my exclusive bonus content where I talk a lot more about sensitive information over there. It's great stuff that I break down more in long form. I can really get into the meat of things. Um, I can break it down just in a way I can't do on YouTube. We don't have to worry about the censorship. And you always get alerts and notifications for anything I put up on Patreon. Unlike on YouTube, you never know when you're going to get an alert the way that they censor. So thank you guys for the support on the Patreon platform. Now, what's going on with California? Well, Attorney General Xavier Becerra making an announcement on Monday that as starting on July 1st, they are going to be banning public funded trips for state employees to the state of Idaho. But why? Oh, because Idaho passed a law that said that boys aren't allowed to participate in girls' sports. So those boys who identify as transgender are no longer able to compete in female sports. Now, I did a separate video on that a couple of weeks back, and this has since now raised a lot of eyebrows. ACLU is upset about this, saying that it's, oh, it's injustice. It's, you're, you can't do that. You know, it's whatever they identify as. They should be allowed to play on the girls' teams. Well, that's not the only bill that California Attorney General is fuming about. It's also the other one that states that, well, if you are transgender, if you identify as something else other than your biological sex, well, you still will not be able to change your biological sex on your birth certificate. It's going to remain the same uh, if you were born as Fred and you now uh, identify yourself as, uh, oh, I don't know, Fiona. Sorry, you're going to still be Fred. Male, you're not going to be allowed to change it on the birth certificate. So this is what California has done. Uh, and this is, this is not something that's brand new, by the way. This is going to be the 12th state that's right the 12th state idaho is the 12th state that california has now banded you know publicly funded trips for state employees with similar situations other states where in their minds it's uh showing unfair treatment to lgbt uh, a list of other states uh, i'll put those down below in the description section you guys can take a look for yourself uh, but this is the way california wants to operate themselves uh, they think that they have it um in their in their will and their power to dictate to people where, when, and where they can't go, and you know, basically say they're not going to cover it. It's not going to be funded. And if you want to go, you'd have to cover your own way. So this is insanity, guys, um, on display uh, at its finest. Let me know your thoughts on this down below in the comment section. What do you think? California banning the travel to Idaho. What do you think about Idaho's decision? Would you like these laws they put into place? I think they're great. That's just me. What do you think? I'll be back with more. You guys take care. Please be safe out there. God bless each and every single one of you. And I'll talk. With you soon.